Damn, Sway, I can't believe you said that. I can't believe you said that, Sway. What the heck, man? I can't believe you said that. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. It's just my opinion. And ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Sway. That's right. Welcome to the channel where I give you my absolute honest opinion and I don't give a damn how you feel about it. <laughs> and as always, I have a trusty smoke, a trusty Coke. And before I get started, do not forget to hit like, make a comment, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification icon so you can be notified of every time that I post a video. Yeah. All right. So uh, first, just some housekeeping out of the way. I want to thank each and every one of you who, uh, who bought me a coffee, uh, who bought me a coffee, who donated through uh, PayPal, Venmo, Cash App. You have no idea how much that means to me. You have no idea. You know, every little penny helps. Uh, every little penny helps. Every little penny helps. It does. Uh, especially for this upcoming operation as well as something that, I, uh, that I'm saving money for. Uh, it's really important to me. And I don't want to let the cat out of the bag yet. But it's just very important to me. It's a surprise that I'm working on. Um, so you know, if if you know you like what I do, you you like uh, you like what I do, and uh, you're and if you're able to, and if you're willing, uh, you know, buy me a coffee, uh, you know, send me a dollar or something through Cash App, Venmo, uh, PayPal. You know, every little penny helps. Every little penny helps. Uh, I'm really appreciated. Yeah, I mean, you have no idea. This is uh, this is actually a very extreme personal thing to me. And, you know, I, and no matter what, you know, no matter what, how I joke around and how I try to be so upbeat and everything, this is very, uh, real, real touching personal thing to me, to my heart. And I will, uh, let you, you know, I'll let you in on it soon. Um, it's, it's hard for me to really talk about it, but, uh, you know, it's cause I don't want, I don't want to let it out yet, but you know what? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so, so if, if you if you want to, and you're willing, and you're if you're willing, you're able to. You want to uh, make a do, you know make a donation uh, through buy you know buy me a coffee, PayPal, uh, Venmo, Cash App. Uh, hey, I appreciate it. Like I said, every penny help helps. Um, if you are unable to, you are unable to, or even if you're unwilling, <laughs> uh, but you want to support this channel. There's another way to support this channel. And it's absolutely free. All you got to do is share my videos. All you got to do is share my videos. Make sure that when you watch my videos, you hit the like. You even hit the dislike. Hey, I really don't care. You know, hit the like, hit the dislike, you know, make a comment, you know, just help help out the, the YouTube algorithms. Um, because my ultimate goal is to get up to a thousand subscribers by the end of this year. And I got a couple months left, you know. Uh, so if you want to help out, you know, if, if you are unable to help out in, in one way, you can help out another way. And that's just sharing the videos. That's just sharing the videos is that simple. Uh, either way, share the videos. You know, you like if you like what I do and whatever, um, feel free, feel free. You know, just share the videos, share them everywhere you can. Tell your friends, your family, hey, subscribe to him, subscribe to Sway, you know, uh, <laughs> it's that simple. Uh, all right, so now that's out of the way. Um, all right, another thing is that uh, I used to I used to promote my email, my you know my contact for this channel, my contact email for this channel, and for my other channel, Soy Skits. I used to put it in the description box below in previous videos, and I got uh, it was funny because I, I received an email. I received an email uh, earlier today. Uh, uh, and my, my email is Josue Mercado Productions at uh, protonmail.com. Uh, yeah, I didn't want to use Gmail <laughs> for anything, uh, for that at least. Anyway, so uh, now I'm going, I'm going to blur out the, the email and all that stuff that it came from. But it says, 
Hey Sway, I found your email on one of your old videos. I have a question. How come in some videos you repeat yourself concerning your point of view towards certain issues? I get it. I get it. You love everyone regardless, uh, Jay. Well, Jay, this is my response to you. The reason why I tend to repeat myself is, is quite simple. In this day and age, in this day and age, I mean, it's 2021 for crying out loud. You know what I'm saying? You know, and, and and I always tell everybody I'm a Christian, you know, I'm a Christian and, and I've said in many other videos on a Christian minister and what have you. Right. And one of the things that really pisses me off is when I see so much hatred, bigotry and bullshit. Uh, coming from people that call themselves Chris, uh, Christians, you know what I mean? Uh, it, it's, it, it really irritates the heck out of me. It, it irritates the hell out of me when I see someone who calls themselves a Christian showing so much bigotry and hatred towards somebody just because of either uh, of their religious belief or of... Uh, or, or of their race or, you know, uh, or of their lifestyle or, 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 or pretty much for any reason, you know what I'm saying? And, it, you know, it's, it, 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 and it's really sad because, you know, um, you know, I, I, I know people from all walks of life, you know, I know, I know people from all walks of life where, um they've been hurt by somebody who claims to be a Christian. They've been hurt severely from someone who, who, you know, who, who calls themselves a Christian. And, you know, and my point of view is this, is that, you know, if, 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 you know, if I'm, if, you know, if, if I'm going to be calling out, if I'm going to be calling out the bullshit, what, um, concerning ufology, right concerning ufology if i'm going to call out the bullshit concerning ufology also as but also as a minister i got to call out the bullshit concerning christianity i got to call out the assholes concerning christianity you know so so when so when i see when i see something i got to say something you know if if anybody's hating you know if if anybody's hating you just just because uh, you're black, you're white, uh, you're Muslim, you're Jew, you're uh, Buddhist, uh, Wiccan, uh, atheist. If somebody if somebody's hating you because you're you know you're you're gay, lesbian, transgendered, uh, whatever, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You know what you know what your background is or or whatever. That's wrong for them to show anybody so much hatred just because of who they are. And if I don't, and if I don't come out and say something about that, you know, of all the hatred, if I don't, if I don't come out and say something uh, uh, of all that hatred that comes out of these people who call themselves Christians, and if I don't come out and, and say something, uh, then I'm part of the problem. I'm part of the problem, you know, and, and, I, it, 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 and it's, it's really a shame because, you know, I've seen, I've seen so many of, of my friends from different walks of life, they've experienced that, you know, they've experienced this hatred, you know, uh, whether it was my Muslim friends, my Buddhist friends, my atheist friends, whether it was my friends who were black, white, uh, I mean, uh, uh, you know, uh, Asian, whether it was my friends who were, um, you know, who, who are, are in the LGBT uh, Q plus community or whatever. Uh, I mean, it's, it, it's, it's a damn shame. It's a damn shame. And if I don't say something about it, you know, yeah, I might repeat myself over and over again, but that's because it's a damn shame. And if somebody doesn't say something and do something, then I'm part of the, I'm part of the problem. I'm part of the problem of this hatred, you know, and, uh, and it, it's just a damn shame. It's it, it's a damn shame, you know. Uh, so, yeah, I might repeat myself over and over again concerning some issues, but that's because, like I said, if I don't say something, that I'm part of the problem. And I hope that explains uh, that, that that explains it as to why I do that. Um, I hope that explains it. I hope that explains it. Uh, also. I, uh, onto something else. Uh, I noticed I lost a subscriber. Wow. whoop de doo Yay. You know, and it was probably from the last video. It was probably from the last video. If there's a, it probably was from the last video. 
and uh, you know, and and every all of my true all of my true subscribers, you know, the people that that they they know me, they know me, they've known me long enough, they know me, whatever. They they know that what I try to do is I try to give uh, a balance. Uh, as much of a balanced view as I can concerning whatever topic I'm talking about, you know what I mean? Um, and, and in the last video concerning why I, uh, I don't associate myself or affiliate myself with uh, any churches or whatever, you know, it needed to be said, it needed to be said of, you know all the all the hypocrisy and all the bullshit that goes on within uh within uh, at least the the protestant side of things um so i don't know maybe they got pissed off because i you know i i said i said some things that I, i'm just telling you look i'm not saying i condone it that hello that's the reason why i don't associate and affiliate myself it's because i don't condone it you know, all the bullshit, you know, um, but hey, you know what, whatever, it is what it is, okay, on to the news, all right, everybody, on to the news, and this news actually came from my young friend, Scarlett Her. no, that is not her real name, that is not her real name, and I'm, and uh, I'm not telling you, <laughs> and my young friend, Scarlett Her. And she says, hey, can you do the guy named Cameron that ran over a mom and a baby while speeding 100 miles per hour? Okay, so it's quite simple. Uh, and it took me a while to it took me a while to finally get to this because it, actually she wrote this about a month ago. Uh, it took me a while to finally get to this because with all the different projects I'm doing and whatever. Uh, okay, so apparently this was this situation happened three years ago where a uh 20 at the time a 21 year old uh kid named cameron heron <clears throat> gathered some uh a 21 year old uh, cameron heron or uh he he decided to drag race okay he challenged another young kid to drag race in uh in, Flo in tampa florida so uh they drag raced and they killed a young mother with her child. Okay. They killed a mother. I say young mother, you know, because, you know, um, but the, the, the articles say uh, killed a mother and her child. And when, when, uh, when, when Cameron crashed into them during that race, um, I'm gonna post. I'm gonna post a YouTube video and an article in the description box below. And uh, and I apologize. For, I keep I keep doing the us and ums because it's you know it's just I don't write anything down really. And I've said that like a thousand times before. I know. <laughs> but anyways, so this young kid, you know, young kid, and, and by now he's 24. By now he's 24 because about a month ago there was a, uh, it was an, I guess it was an appeal or whatever. But anyway, this young kid, uh, he he goes onto TikTok. Okay, he goes onto TikTok and uh, he's like, no, I'm you know I'm I'm too pretty. Basically, yeah, I'm just I'm just paraphrasing. You know, I'm paraphrasing, kind of making fun of the kid. He's like, no, I'm too pretty to go to prison. Please, you know, the judge can't make me go to prison. I'm too pretty. I'm too pretty. I'm too pretty. That sort of attitude. So now the other the other kid the other kid got I believe 24 years. The other kid got like 24 years, uh, a plea deal. Okay uh yeah it says it, it says last and it says in and it says uh, last year last year the other kid uh Barianu, took a state offer and pleaded guilty to homicide and unlawful and now serve oh a six year prison sentence sorry okay sorry he's so now he's doing six years in prison and earlier this year this is about a month ago uh a month ago he 
when he goes in front of the judge, he never took a plea deal, whatever he was going to try to do an open plea. And the judge gave him 24 years. Okay. The judge gave him 24 years. What the frig? I believe it was 24 years. I'm, I'm trying to find the actual number. Yeah, I think it was 24 years. But anyway, regardless of whatever, right? Yeah. 24, yeah, a, uh, a 24 year prison sentence. Um, what the frig, man? What the fuck? So, throughout all of this time, he's he's uh, he's on TikTok, he's on TikTok, he's on Twitter, he's he's trying to you know, and, and he's like, hey, I'm too young, I'm too young, I'm too pretty, I'm too good looking, okay, and that's the whole thing is because of you know he's a good looking kid. You know, that's, you know, he's like, I'm too good looking. I'm too good looking. I can't, I can't go to prison. I can't go to prison. I can't be somebody's bitch. And that's what I'm assuming he said. <laughs> but anyway, so. He's getting support from a lot of women on TikTok. A lot of, you know, he's, he's getting support from a lot of women on TikTok and on Twitter. What the entire F for real? What the entire F is wrong with this? And here's and here's here's one of the things, you know, here's one of the things is that they may, you know, you gotta you do the crime, you do the time, right? And he's you know. Uh, a lot of these young kids, when they turn 18, a lot of these young kids, when they turn, and trust me, I know, I've seen it so many times, you know, from my little brother to now my niece, where they turn 18, and they're, and they're like, I'm 18, I'm 18, I'm 18, I'm a, I'm a grown up, I'm 18, blah, 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 blah. And, you know, and I actually, I had this conversation with my niece not too long ago, about a week ago, and I told her, look, being 18 don't mean jack shit. All, all being 18 means is that if you do something stupid, if you do something stupid, you get tried as an adult. Okay, you do something stupid, you got to suffer the consequences as an adult. Okay, and there's consequences to everything. You know, the word consequence is not good or bad. It just means a result or effect of an action or condition. So if you do something good, you know, something good is going to happen. Uh, that's the consequence. If you do something bad, something bad is going to happen. And that's the consequence, right? So you know, while you're young, you know, you stay in school, you know, and I would say stay in school, get your education, get your education, stay in school, um, you know, study hard, don't skip school, don't be a knucklehead like I was and, and skip a couple of classes here and there, you know. <laughs> But you know, I did graduate high school, you know. But like I said, it's uh, it's it's don't don't be a knucklehead, you know. Uh, do what you can, you know what I mean. Um, don't be like this stupid kid that, oh, I'm gonna drag race and oh no, I got caught. Oh no, I killed a mom and her child. I'm too pretty to go to prison. I'm too pretty to be someone's bitch in prison. That's 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 really what's gonna happen. That's what's gonna happen. You know what I mean? But uh, this kid is stupid. And that, that's my honest opinion. This kid is stupid. You know what I mean? Um, I'm sure this was not the first time that he's ever drag, uh, drag raced. I am sure he, this is not the first time that he ever drag raced. You know, I, I think this is the first time he got caught. I re there's, there's really no details if, if he's ever been arrested for it before. So, I, but I'm sure he, this is not the first time he's ever drag raced. And, you know, he's just never, he was never caught that simple. Um, but he killed a, you know, I'm sure he, I'm sure with that attitude, oh, I'm, you know, I'm 21 or whatever. I can do whatever the fuck I want. I'm going to drink. I'm going to do this, that, and the other. And he drag raced another kid and they killed a young mother and, and her child. And, and, and then instead of really trying to fix himself and instead of really trying to fix himself and trying to uh make the situation better and whatever he goes on to tiktok and twitter he's like no i can't go to prison because i'm too pretty nah man you know nah screw that shit 
Screw that shit. That's not good. Um, that's all I got to say about that. You know, that's, those, uh, the article and the YouTube video from the news is going to be in the description box below. This was just a fun little video just to kind of uh, give a response to the email that I got as well as uh, as well as to 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 give an opinion as to uh, the, the you know I, I, what happened but due to the request from my young friend and uh, that's it for now that's it for now you know and like I always tell you I'm sway I love each and every one of you peace. Hey everybody, this is Sway and I just want to remind each and every one of you to check out Out of Mind. That's right, check out the Out of Mind website for a lot of great content, everything from UFOs, conspiracy theories, world news, you name it. Pretty soon I'll be doing a lot of content for Out of Mind that you will not find on this channel, so check it out at oom the number 2com That's uma2.com. Also, if you want to support my channel and you want to buy some merchandise, we have I Don't Give a Damn merchandise. And if you also want to buy me a coffee, send me a cash out, Venmo, or PayPal, all of that information is in the description box below. It's just my opinion.